So we're here with Simon Duke, Managing Director of Fishbowl Inventory Australia. Now Simon, I know you don't necessarily want to talk about this, but what is your background? How did you get started in all this account, accounting software inventory technology space? Yeah, okay. Well, look, Clayton, um, I guess straight out of high school, I, I started working in an accounting firm, and, and very early on, I started working for you. So um, that was. I think back... you were our number. Sorry to interrupt, but I think you're like number two or three team member. I think what? I might have been. It was pretty early days. Um, so back then, obviously, we were in the midst of GST rollout in Australia. So my background was really accounting software. So uh, we worked in that space where a lot of businesses or small businesses were adopting accounting software for the first time, and it was. Uh, it was very new for everybody, both clients um, and probably accounting firms as well. So I had years and years of, uh, of setting up and supporting businesses on their accounting package. Uh, back in those days, it was typically QuickBooks or, or MYB. Um, but from there, I, I had an opportunity to move to the US and, and work for a race car company, which is a passion of mine, and um, got to experience using Fishbowl uh, in an end user environment where you know, manufacturing race cars is not the most simple thing in the world. So we, we, we had a fairly large setup with about 11,000 part numbers and over 3,000 bill of materials in that company. And it really took a, a period for us to transition the business from a paper-based business to, to what we were running on Fishbowl. And, and since then, and, and, and launching Fishbowl in Australia back in 2011, you know, I still remember the, the day we flew back from the US and uh, we had one customer in Australia on Fishbowl and we had Fishbowl on a USB stick and we did our first implementation on site with that client. And I guess since then we've, we've implemented hundreds. In fact, it's well over the, the 500 companies now. Uh, so it's about 3,000 uh, 3, users since we, since we launched. And uh, every one of those clients we've worked with across all those different industries, there's been either myself or one of our consultants team on site doing implementation with them. So I guess looking back, yeah, there's a lot of experience in, in different industries that we've, we've touched on since day one. And, uh, I guess that just continues to expand. Um, every client, even though there may be an industry we've touched on, uh, I guess we have a chat to them about what their unique needs are, and um, from there, you know, I get we more experience. So, yeah. yeah, and I think that's the thing that um, probably resonates with people is the fact that um, you guys are sort of. I mean, I view that you're industry experts in inventory, inventory management solutions, um, you know, warehousing, distribution, um, you know, all, all those areas that Fishbowl actually handles. So you're taking that knowledge and experience that you're actually um, gaining by working with, you know, hundreds of different clients, and then the very next person that walks in the door, it's a high chance that you've already worked with their industry. Is that what you're finding? Yeah, it is. We have, um, I guess, over the, over the last few years found that we have a, a a group of clients in certain niches, you know, whether that be food production or or boutique breweries. That's a big thing in Australia. So we have a bunch of those as clients. Um, so there's all these little industries or, or verticals where we've found we've had a little bit of a sweet spot for. And and with having multiple clients in the same vertical industries, we have kind of whether it be written some customer reports that suits them very well, such as an excise report for beer. Um, so yeah, we have kind of built up these little niche functional sets that work very well for those types of businesses, but. But yeah, it really is about, there is a lot of inventory, inventory solutions out there now, especially in the cloud space. Um, but I guess we still take things a little bit more personally where every one of our jobs is done on site. So, and we really listen to what the client's needs are and uh, work out how Fishbowl can be used to fit that, that business need, um, whether it be unique or the same as the last client we are at. So where's the future taking you and Fishbowl, do you think? Yeah, well, I guess uh, first up, we don't plan on going anywhere. Um, so over the next few years, I do see probably the integration with more general ledger packages. So all the mainstream packages, you've got your Zero, QuickBooks, Intuit Online, uh, Reckon Accounts, MIB, perhaps Sage. So there's a bunch of players out there in the, the accounting software market now. And I guess what we see ourselves as is the operational software. And we want to end up in a space where whatever the business's accounting needs are, we can push the data back to that. Um, as well as moving into emerging markets. So from a, from a business point of view, there's emerging markets around Australia um, where they're starting to upskill themselves in more technology. Um, so that's somewhere that we'll be looking at as well. Yeah, fantastic. It's just been great seeing the progression, I suppose, over, um, I don't, it's, it's nearly 20 years. I know you don't, don't look a day older, but I certainly do. Um, I think I'm catching up. <laughs> and yeah, I'm, I'm excited to see um, where, where this all goes for you and the Fishbowl team. Cool, thank you. Thanks, Simon.